Good morning, boys and girls. My name is Mr. Burden. Good morning. I'm Mr. Wall. And today we have another Tinkercad challenge for you. Guess what, boys and girls? Spring is finally just around the corner. I can almost taste it. I love everything spring. I especially love strawberries. And I know we've had some winter frosts and things like that, but Mr. Wall got a little overzealous. I bought 50 strawberry plants because you, you can't believe how much I love strawberries. But now I have this problem, right? I need to plant all of these and I don't have enough garden space to put them all out. So I thought, you know what? I'm going to have to have some pots. And I thought, you know what? This could be fun for the students to create pots for plants themselves. So just like I have a problem with too many strawberries, I'm sure you have just been so anxious to get out there and plant things. And maybe you bought more seeds than you could possibly plant. So can you create a pot in Tinkercad, design it, create it, add special effects, add different things, maybe give it a handle, you know, whatever you want to do. Um, probably make sure it has holes in the bottom because that is one thing that water has to drain through. But things to consider when you're making a pot for plants. Have fun with it, boys and girls. Mr. Burden's going to talk a little bit more about the logistics piece. All right, so when we think about the 3D printing part of this, as you guys design in Tinkercad your creations, we had mentioned the other day about the being able to 3D print, and I've already started to receive some emails with some of your designs, and boys and girls, I am so impressed by your abilities and your creativity, so excited to continue to see some designs. But as you have some designs for even today's challenge, uh, again, reach out to uh, Mr. Wall and I by sending us an email of a screenshot of your design. And then what our plan is, is this weekend to uh, reach back out to those of you who had sent us your designs and then to come up with some logistics of how we can go about 3D printing and more importantly, getting them into your hands, which we know with the uh, with everything that's going on around us, that's going to be a challenge. But we've we have some ideas of how we can go about doing that. So as you continue to come up with your designs, take screenshots of them either put them in the comments below or again email them to mr wall and i and we will be in contact with you this weekend about being able to 3d print and how to again get those into your hands so happy creating today have a lot of fun and we're excited to see what else you innovate and what else you make have a great day guys have fun boys and girls